<laughs> oh, yeah. Hi, I'm Tanner Chow. Uh, I am Will Presley. And we are former high school bullies. Yeah. And this is The Breakdown. Which one is this? Uh, so. Back to the Future 1. Hey, McFly! What do you think you're doing? Perfect. Which one's the nerd? Both hey, of them. I'm talking to you, McFly, you Irish bum. Right past him. I like what he's doing there. He's making fun of his race. Well, actually, I he's think loud. Hello? <laughs> Physical contact <laughs> immediately. <laughs> that even sounds like yeah. an egg being cracked. They might have done Foley on that, or it might have been his like crunchy hair. Mm. Nerds love wearing gel okay, in their hair. Too school. much. Yeah, also I like that he had previously assigned him a job, which was his homework. Like if you constantly. can get through high school without having to do any actual homework, mm -hmm. you're doing well. Yeah. Because we both were born in the same year, and I got held back my sophomore year. Mm -hmm. But then the bullying got so bad because I got held back that they put me forward two years. Mm -hmm. So I ended up graduating a year before him. I stayed on track the whole time. Butthead. Hey, 50 year this guy's life preserved. Gloves are a nice touch. Yeah, it's being cool. Like, you know. Never, never eat cereal in public. Oh! <laughs> what I tell you? Don't eat cereal. Oh, what an idiot! Yeah, see, there he goes. Yeah. Thinks they're friends. Thinks they're getting along. This is perfect. It's a classic, this is classic, classic bully movie. They get Oop. in a hot car in the background. Which, at the time, I'm sure that was a hot car. Why don't nerds ever try to take advantage of their own power in this situation? They can. Yeah. That's, uh, that's, that's the danger. Yeah. The, if you remember the movie Bowling for Columbine, when we feel that someone's getting to a certain breaking point, we'll say, this nerd's going bowling and we'll yeah. lay off. For he's a, a bowler. Months. He looks like a bowler. Yeah. He's yeah. going bowling. He's, go he's a bowler. He's going to go hit some pins. Back off. Don't show you're backing off, but back off. You never want to get shot doing what you're doing. Yeah. <clears throat> Plus, like, it is a balancing game. We got to lift him up just sure. as much as we yeah. put him down. I recognize that fist. This is Spider Man. Oh, the Toby Keith one? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, there he goes, the recoil. Do you ever like hit lockers just to prove like oh, yeah. how bad it'll hurt? Yeah. yeah. I like his shirt. It should be popped, but whatever. Yeah. See, this is what I don't like is that he's not getting hit. He's not getting hit, and I also don't like it's not a real movie. He's a spider, so I mean. I believe it if he was like in the super suit, because then people would be like, a superhero beat up a bully, mm. which they'd be like, pretty close to even fight. Oh, so what's cool about these movies though is that they're like, hey nerds, maybe you have superpowers. And then they try to do this like Matrix style lean back, yeah. head in the ground, looks like a total idiot. Yeah. It's like, oh, you thought you were gonna Toby Keith me, but I got your ass. I got you. <clears throat> Where you pause it, I'm thinking about how many kids I could have in those lockers. Man of Steel, Superman has always been kind of a loner. So exactly, I was just talking about Clark Kent. He's not in his outfit. Here he is, grabs his shoulder. Again, smart move, you push the chair back, it's loud, glasses fall over. Mm -hmm. Now most people, here, pause this real quick. Most people think, tiny guy, he's gotta be not the bully. Yeah. But we all know Superman's a good guy. Sure. So like, he's from Iowa. He just doesn't have glasses like in the old school Superman, which quite frankly helped. He has like really good facial hair, really good head of hair. Really like snake eyes sunken in. You're like, that's a handsome guy. He could have syphilis. I don't want to get this thing bloody. Yeah, and that's the best kind of bully is like um, weaponized blood. When your victim's not sure about your bill of health, that's always a plus. Mm hmm. Probably just. Leave yeah, I love that. Side. Or fear Chata. in the face. Oh, fear. Classic. Oh. We got some military here. And now he's like squint. Oh, my eyes. Don't ask, don't tell. Oh, there he is. <laughs> Now that's, that's where I don't believe this anymore because it's like that he did everything right. He had the perfect yeah, foot plan. Yeah, I mean, what are you going to do? He's from He really planet. whapped his arms down on a geek's chest and it's like... You asshole, don't forget your tip. You really want to like... In case anybody didn't think I won that fight... Yeah. Can to the back can. of the head. And since he's now left, you can go back to harassing the waitress. Do all bullies have good arms like the bully from this video? I think so. I've never thought I, about it. I have got a great arm. Yeah. I wrestled in high school, so I was throwing all kinds of sizes of men around. Try to grab a face of a kid with pimples and then touch anything afterwards. It, you gotta have, like, wrench tight fingers. Yeah. Yeah. I threw half a tire at a kid from Ecuador in 10th grade. This is the part of this movie 
that's absolutely unbelievable, without a doubt. I've yeah. never seen. That. I don't even think I could do that to a truck. He didn't deserve that. That's his livelihood. Superman too. is essentially putting this guy out on the streets yeah. over what? A beer? Yeah. This is Adam Sandler and Billy Madison. Nice. Awesome. Is that his name, O'Doyle? O'Doyle. Smart. Rules. Let him know what the last name is. Yeah. You gotta say it right away. Trash can. Oh, I think this is a compilation because they're really cut into all the yeah. O'Doyle rules. Are these all O'Doyles? Yeah. Judging okay. the hair, which you know, in this scenario, redheads, not typical that they'd be in charge. Shit in the oh. locker. What a classic. Let's him know that you are rule. And you have access to a lot of land. Exactly. That he could disappear. I was just in. thinking. I have access to land. I have access to endless amounts of shit. Your life is shit. What kind of shit was that? That was cow shit. Yeah, for sure. Those are the size. Might have been bison, but based on where they are, I don't think they're out west. What was that? Okay. They slipped on a banana. The car slipped on a banana. Which again, this is what are we watching? Spider-Man again? See the. Since the left has won the culture war, people like seeing bullies die, I don't particularly get my rocks off seeing a family go over a cliff. A whole, a whole family? Oh, this is my favorite day of the week, and I love this movie. This Hell is Friday. Oh, yeah. I'm Debo. I've never seen this before. Debo. Debo. That's the guy from Are We There Yet? In reverse, they announced who's coming. I've never seen this, but I know now I know that Debo is the boss. And he's big as hell and bald. Yeah, I like Debo because A, his victims know his name, they announce when he's coming, and he's got music playing mm -hmm. when he shows up. Oh, also, bullies never have kickstands. No. Drop your shit. This is my yard. I own it. What's up, Red? Thanks for the bike. Thanks for the bike. He thanked him for the thing he took from him. Yeah, he took his bike, yeah. And I wonder where he got that shiner from. I do. Hell yeah. Points at him like a gun. Now make them turn against each other. Mm -hmm. It's like, leave the situation, let them fight it out. That's a, a yep. prime situation that you want. Especially if you can do that in front of girls. Oh! Adios. Now that's accurate. I have launched a dork. The neighborhood heard that. Yeah. Established again, bike. your Punk. bike is mine. One of your assistants comes up, the dad's out of the car. And punk is not in my vernacular, but I loved how that sounded. Yeah, I really wish beautiful. I could drop a punk on somebody. Dad's not having it. Get yep. this dork in the car, go home. If you can ever He's establish dominance by hitting a kid so hard he flies through the air and everyone hears it and his father backs down from fighting you, now that family. You have that family's lineage. Yeah. Have you guys ever uh, been able to establish dominance over a whole family? Yeah, Tanner has slept with several people's mothers. All right, this is this a guy. This is Casino, a.k.a. Goodfellas, part two. You can't bully a dead person. Yeah. They wanted information from him, I guess, is what we were watching. I mean, like, I rarely want information, because then I have to remember it. Yeah, I don't. This is called Mean Girls. We have to talk to you. Is Butter a carb? So far, they're all hot. I don't know who's Gina? the bully. Oh, yeah, I remember her. It's Monday. So? Brunette just bossed around the blonde. She's But she likes rules. That girl's in the notebook. We played that at my wedding. I remember her. You can't sit with us! Yelling. Not but kind of losing her temper, you yeah, know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sweatpants are all that fits me right now. She gained weight. That's all I wear is sweatpants. She just gained weight and she's embarrassed by it. Embarrassment is a nerd trait. These are all hot women. I don't understand what's going on. She called him bitches and left. That's the bully right there. Watch her, you're going fast. And she called her good. fat ass, and everybody laughed. It's a newer bully movie. This is Zero Dark Thirty. Is that a football movie? The rest of the Saudi group. So right now, this guy's got info, and I think they're just pouring water on him. But you figure it's a desert. He's probably thirsty, so I'm, they might be doing him a favor. No. 
Cool. This is another movie I have not seen. This is Revenge of the Nerds, 1984. Oh, Looks girl. like it's 9 a.m. There's a blonde drinking a beer. I love that. Nobody's wondering who's in charge. They're all yelling it. Ogre. Yeah. I don't think. I think they're in charge. He's only saying one word, which is like a thing that Pokemon do, but also like a good bully might. He's screaming nerds at the new ones. Yeah. He's establishing that he's holding the other nerds, so he's more than likely the bully. He gets everybody else behind him. Yeah. Again, group mentality is so strong here. Yeah. And then they flee. Yeah. What do you think? Audio, visual, psychological. He's checking off all the boxes. Mm -hmm. Venn diagram's complete. These kids are terrified. The kid that he dropped might be dead. And at the end of the day, he's passing college, and he's got a blonde drinking a beer next to him. Mm -hmm. we, we don't see that nerd. So as far as nerds know, that nerd's gone. This is Full Metal Jacket, one of my favorites. Do you think I'm funny? Sir, no, sir. Again, like loud, in his face, sir, yes, sir. and he's fucking with him. He fucking and he's like an easy one to pick on. Sir, yeah. Fine. You've got a big head. He knows he's not going to be able to not stop smiling. When you know your victim can't stop doing something, like being short, yes. highlight that. Yes. This is my favorite move of all time. Have you ever made someone do push-ups before? Yes. It is liberating. I made my grandma do it when she got out of the hospital. Mm -hmm. I think it's the scene I don't want to see. So at this point, he's at the bowling alley. Yeah, this nerd is about to strike, quite frankly. Yeah, he's cosmic bowling. Yeah. Mickey Mouse shit, making fun of him. This is when you as a bully need to be able to realize that the eggs have been scrambled. Yeah. They're not going back in the shell. Back so off. Just back off. Lay low. Pretend like you don't even know the guy. Mm-hmm. What is your major malfunction, num nuts? Didn't mommy and daddy show you enough attention? I mean, he's mm -hmm. right in asking that, but at that point... You gotta know what cards you're holding. Yeah. This one is Karate Kid. This is the original. Mm hmm. Not the remake. No. Good movie, though. Dark versus light. Yeah, I like the Cobra. He's also got great hair. I've always wanted long hair, headband. Yeah, he's got that grizzly man hair. You're dead. That's a classic line. Yeah. I've used that You're about a thousand dead. times. Sweep the leg. Sweep the leg. Yeah, so he's clearly like a mentor character. He's got these like really cro magnon kind of features, which is like, if you're wondering who the bully's listening to, it's that guy. Yeah. That guy looks like he walks on his knuckles, and therefore, you know, he's, he's the leader of the bullies. He's like mm -hmm. the king bully. The Cobra Kai kid, he's put in the work, he's put in the training, the psychological abuse mm -hmm. over the years on Ralph Macchio. So yeah. this is just the icing on the cake. He yeah. should, in theory, be able to pull this off. He's been in the kid's head. Yeah. Which is what I don't like. This is a crowd scene, too. Which could go either way. Bully wins, yeah. everybody's on his side. Bully loses, power shift. Yeah. And, I mean, clearly this victim... Oh. This victim, this dork, he comes from a loving family, so he's going to go home and get love and support, whereas... This Cobra Kai kid. He's gonna go get yelled at by yeah. that case. So, man. I mean, who really wins? Who loses? Is Hollywood happy with this result? I don't know. I'm not. Bare knuckle, punch to the jaw. You know, in a lot of movies, you see bullies punching people in the head. The head is a really strong bone. And as often as you can, the reason we do the fake out yeah. is because. Uh, the more knuckle to skull contact, the more likely you are to break your hand. Yeah. And the less we can do to get away with that. Yeah. See, he's immune to it though. We, we yeah. practice this at each other yeah. all the time. The head is the largest organ. So if you can strike it as much as possible, every, all the other organs will shut They'll down. They'll just give up, yeah. And I'm not sure exactly what type of karate this is, but if elbows were a feasible option, I would absolutely implement an elbow. Yeah. Um, my sensei and senpai said that I have world-class elbows, so... Oh. See, See that? You're not gonna ever want to walk straight into no. someone's foot like that. It's important to remember, too, that with all these movies, all these victims are going through a lot. And just like in life, if you are a loser, if you're ugly, if you smell bad, if you're just too smart, 
just realize that we are here to help you. Sounds as familiar. Always. Sounds Some familiar, sound viewers. Familiar? If you can go through what we put you through, take the lumps, the beatings, and come out the other side, you're probably going to turn out to be okay. And we'd like to thank the sponsors of this video, Make-A-Wish. Um, check them out. Online.com This is a recording. Please hang your phone up now. Um, who are you looking forward to bullying this week? I don't know. I don't really look forward to a lot, so...